Oh yeah, Laura here. Today I have got some friend mail and I got another friend mail from Kaylee Wesley. And here's the box she sent. So I'm going to open this up and we can see what's in it together. So Kelly is such a sweetheart and you will love watching Kaylee. So I'm going to link her in the cards. I'm going to hope that's the right side. I'm not entirely certain in this room. I think that's right. If it's not, it'll be up there instead. And please go and check out Kaylee and see what she's all about. And she is amazing and she does lots of videos and she really enjoys it. And it shows on camera how much she enjoys it. And I'm really excited to dig into this box. So let's see what she sent me. So today I am wearing, on my face today, I am wearing my Shop My Stash stuff from um, End of August, I think I will say. <laughs> so it was my, what I would add into the Natasha Denona palette, the gold palette if I had it. So, and the earrings that I'm wearing are the ones that I got from Kaylee last time she sent me a parcel. So, um, I think she decided she needed to send me another parcel because she didn't feel like she had sent me enough, which is total rubbish because she had, I love the parcel she sent me. And I haven't got anywhere to put her beautiful painting in this room because I'm in a different room to what I was before because my daughter's home from university at the moment, I had to move out. So I'm in this little tiny, tiny space at the moment and the lighting may not be that great because it's really bright outside and I've closed the curtain, but it's making it a bit dark in here even though I've got all the lights on. Hang on, there's one light I haven't got on. I'll see if that makes a difference. Let me just turn it to a white light. Does that make any difference? Possibly, I'm not sure. But hopefully the lighting won't be too bad and you can see what I'm doing. So she sent me some butter bronzer. Yay! Physician's formula. I can't get this in New Zealand at all. She actually sent me two. Hang on, are they different colours? Yeah, light bronzer and sun-kissed bronzer. But she obviously wasn't sure what colour I should be. If one of them is too light, I can pass one on to my daughter. So, wow. Thank you, Kelly. That's really nice. I'm going to smell it because I keep hearing people say, oh, it smells really great. And then some people say, no, it's way too strong. So I want to see what it smells like. It's a pretty package. It doesn't want to come out. <laughs> Look at the great colours. I'm sure you've all seen this before. But it's really pretty colours. Okay, let's see if I can open it. I can't open it. <laughs> it's stuck. But oh, here we go. I was... Ah, uh, I see. It's got the little brush thingy in the bottom. It's like a sponge brush. I don't think I'll be using it. Yeah, it smells like suntan lotion. Copper tone suntan lotion. That's what it smells like. Because it's got that coconut smell. And then it's got a cool pattern on it. It looks like a nice colour. That was the sun kissed bronzer. And the light bronzer. Actually, I think she said she was going to put one in for my daughter. So. Whichever one's the lighter one will be the one for my daughter. Okay, it's, ah, it's got a little button that opens it. And this one's definitely lighter, so this one will be for my daughter. She won't mind if I just washed it. So let's have a look at the difference. Can you see the difference? Oops. So this one's darker. I'm sure she'll enjoy that. Thank you, Kaylee. And thank you for thinking of my daughter as well. Jeez, I've turned her into a make makeup addict like me. I've just put that in the wrong box for her, so I'll have to swap it over. <laughs> and what else have we got here? Because your favourite colour is orange, which it is, it's true. Sassy sea in it. Look at that. Dose of colours. I've never tried dose of colours. Ooh, look. Oh, so sassy. Look how pigmented that is. 
and what's this color here? Bossy. Those are beautiful colors. This matte rusty one looks nice. This one here, brassy. Oh, that looks like the color I was looking for when I was duping the orange palette. <coughs> Somebody's ringing me. Sorry, it was my dad just ringing to see how we were because we've been sick. Okay, I just rubbed my arm of those swatches and they're still there, so that's really pigmented. That's going to be really nice to play with. Those um, browns are going to be just the perfect colour for deepening up orange. And I'm playing with my orange palette. So you can see how those colours will work really well together. Well done, Kaylee. That's beautiful. Thank you very much. And so shiny and sparkly. What else has she got in here? Let's have a look. Bali bronze eye pencil. It's a dark bronzy colour. That's pretty. And a purple pencil. Urban Decay. I've never tried anything from Urban Decay. And it's a purple one. Look at that beautiful purple colour. <laughs> it's quite funny. I sent her a purple eyeliner and now she sent me a purple eyeliner. Mine's different from that though. I'll show you what mine looks like if I can find it. Is that one? No, that's the blue one. <laughs> Where's my purple ones? Here it is. So that's that's my purple one and it's a different tone of purple. I don't know whether that, how well that will show up on camera, but this one, my one's got more of a bluey shift and this one's more of a true purple. Oh, and she sent me a beautiful hair clip. That's pretty. You're going to be able to put my hair up in that. Look nice on the front of a bun as well. Oh, and she did say in one of her videos she was sending me this blush, the Laura Geller Baked Blush. Blush and Brighton Tropic Hues. That's what that one looks like. Because I think she said it was too dark for her. I sent her one. Well, that's really pretty. I sent her one that I said was too light for me. Do we have a little play? I have got blush on already, so I don't know how well this will turn up. But <laughs> we'll have a little play. Because on camera, you can never see the blush that well. That, that looks. That looks like a good colour for me, Kaylee. That's a great colour on me. That's definitely my colour. And I don't think I've got anything quite that colour either. So that's, that's great. Pixie! Now, Pixie by Petra is another thing that I can't get. She's got little notes on them, so this one is, I hope that you like this. It actually came off, so I'm presuming that it came with this, or it came with this one. I'm, I'm not sure. <laughs> but we can't get Pixie where I am either. So she's throwing some Pixie in, which is so nice of her. So it's a Blush Duo, Rose Gold, love Rose Gold. It's got, it's got, it says Rose and then Gold on this side, so. I'm presuming it's a blush and highlighter duo. Doesn't say there, so I'm presuming that's the blush and that's the highlighter. So, it's a pink. And you can swirl it together. Interesting. Okay, I'm just going to throw on some of the highlighter part because I, I think I've got enough blush on. Well, it's a pretty nice natural kind of blush. It's a dark kind of champagne, which is good on me. It's not really a true look at it because I have got some other highlighter, <laughs> but it is pretty. If you can see that. Thank you, Kaylee. That's that's really pretty too. And it's got an interesting. Oh, that's really soft. 
I should have used the, the brush with it. It's a really teeny tiny brush. It reminds me of a really miniature, you know, shaving brush. <laughs> but it is really, really soft. It feels really nice. And then, this brand of highlighter was the first one I ever hit a pan on. Uh, it's an Ofra a highlighter. This one's called Star Island. I have never used this brand either. And look how beautiful that looks. Okay, shall I just put some more highlighter on? Because you always need a bit more highlighter, don't you? Let's have a look. That's very blingy. It's lighter than the other one. Now that I've highlighted three times. <laughs> I feel very glowy. I'd be very curious to see how that highlighter works when I'm not wearing a whole lot of other highlighter as well because I've never used that brand before. So, very, very pretty. And since I'm playing, I may as well play with the bronzer, even though I've already got some on as well. So I'm going to use the Sunkissed bronzer, the darker one, because I think that will actually suit me better. Yeah, it makes my brush smell like coconut. And it'll also tone down some of the highlighter. It's a pretty colour. I like it. It's really pretty. I like everything that she sent me. Oh, there's one more thing that I took out of the box, but I didn't. I hope that you enjoy this palette. I thought of you when I saw it. And we all know what this is, I'm sure. So it was from the Jacqueline, Jacqueline Hill Times Morphe collection. Which one is this one called? Okay, I have a, I can't see the name on it. But it is this one. Whatever this one's called. Oh, Ring the Alarm. It's The name is here. <laughs> so she sent me the Ring the Alarm. Look at that. I, I've never tried Morphe. So, another thing I've never tried, feels nice, I've just swatched, boom, what about bomb ass, that's a very weird name, oh, that is a really nice strawberry colour to go with my strawberry shape palette. Let's try framed, which is the matte. That one needs a little bit of building up. It's a nice burgundy kind of colour. Siren is one of these weird mats with a bit of glitter in it. Let's see what this one does. Feels nice. It's a browner kind of burgundy colour. Rush looks nice too. Rush is sort of an orangey brown. Goes really well with my shirt. <laughs> and I wanted to try Lolly because it looks pretty. which it is, a very beautiful warm pink, and warm pink suit me, so that's really pretty. On camera is the gold one. I'm not really swatching them all, <laughs> although I am really. I'm going to have to do a look with these things. That gold also goes perfectly with my shirt. It's a kind of a dark gold, that one. So I, I did swatch a lot of them. There's only about three colours that I haven't swatched. But all of them are looking pretty good. Those shimmers are just lovely. 
I'm actually pretty pleasantly surprised with the way those shimmers feel and swatch. It'll be interesting to see how they work because I've had so many different reports on this collection and some people got palettes that weren't very good but this one seems to be really good. I saw um, Kitty J got friend mail from her as well and she got a couple of these as well and she said the formula felt nice as well. So thank you very much Kaylee. You are a sweetheart and I love you so much. We um even though we're miles apart, we've only met on YouTube and we've talked a bit on Instagram and that she's just one of those people that I just click with instantly and she's so sweet and nice and genuine and I just love it a bit and please go and check out Kaylee's channel I will put her link down below she, she is very real and fun and she will play with makeup because she loves it she's not in it for the money she's not trying to sell you stuff or anything she does it because she loves it and she loves playing with color and she loves experimenting and like me she's learning as well because neither of us are makeup experts but we just love playing with makeup that's what we love to do and we love color <laughs> so she is such a sweetheart thank you so much Kaylee for your friend mail I feel very honored and very special and if I could convince my daughter to try out the physician's formula butter bronzer that you gave her on camera I would but I can guarantee that there is no way she's going anywhere near a camera for me <laughs> so um, I, won't, I won't be able to show her reaction to that but if I could I definitely would <laughs> I'm gonna put it in the right box so that she gets it in the right box and that is so sweet of you to send me stuff but also send her something yeah if I turn it around look she'll, ne she'll never know I opened it now <laughs> even though I stuck my finger on it you can't really tell though so thank you for watching everyone and thank you Kaylee you're fantastic I love you and I look forward to seeing your videos every time they come up in my feed and if I haven't seen them in a while I always go looking for them <laughs> so just in case YouTube decides not to tell me that you've put a video out so I'll see you all next time. Bye.